came here. Uh, I got a very special evening. It's a evening I've been looking forward to for a long time. Uh, I'm going to be speaking once again after so many years. Uh, Logan, I thank you all for sitting up here with us. Let me get you a seat over here. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, go ahead. Is it too late? Hmm? No, no, there's people moving. It's only. Right.
pass this legislation. Many are now saying that this is why he ran for the Alabama Senate. <coughs> if he should, and this hasn't happened yet, if he should move the indefinite postponement Senate Bill 289, you can be sure that we'll see it again at, at a future date. That's why we're having this meeting. That's the only reason we're having this meeting. Because I'm convinced that this man is so intent on passing this legislation, we will see it again. Now, the sheet that we have out at the top of the page is quoting from the article. Get a single. Yes, David, and I'm The bottom part of the page shows you the status of Senate Bill 289, and what does it say? Pending. Committee board. What does that mean, Pam? It could be voted out of committee tomorrow and be on the Senate floor the next day. Uh, the only, if you see the words indefinitely postponed there, then, then it's gone. Or she could reintroduce it in a different number. But there's all kind of maneuvering and things that he can do. Um, and, and that's why, I, as I said, that's why we're having this meeting. Both Larry Stutz and Tim Nelson were invited to this meeting tonight. We even have chairs coming down there. I'm disappointed, but really not surprised that they're not here. Why am I not surprised? They have repeatedly, and I'm going to show you a pattern, they have repeatedly refused to come to meetings. They have refused to attend scheduled meetings that they were requested to attend by elected officials, county and city officials. <clears throat> now if I can get this thing to work, uh, we're going to be a bit. Stunts, attendance at meeting, meetings of which legislators were asked to attend. On January 5th, 2015, the Lauderdale County Board of Education, Lawrence, asked us to attend the meeting to brief us, and Stutz attended. January 6th, 2015, there was a pre K to 12th grade education task force. This was comprised of superintendents, principals, board members, teachers, everybody in the education community for three counties, Lauderdale, Calvert, and Franklin County. On that January 6th meeting, Stutz did not attend. On January 8th, the Calvert County Development Commission asked us to come to the courthouse. This is the group that oversees the PBA and local tax money. That's used to <coughs> On January the 29th, the NACOG board meeting was held at the NACOG office. Stutz arrived late, and the schedule had to be rearranged for everyone there to accommodate his targets. February 2nd, 2015, Calgary County officials asked us to come to the Calvert County Courthouse. Stutz did not attend. 2000, excuse me, January. What Thank <laughs> you. 
Technology is one of the first words. Richard, you carry the stunning song, don't we?